Hello Carson! This is my video for databases where I'm showing off this super cool website. Uh, we'll go ahead and run it and we'll show all the functionality. I need a new Chrome window though. Let's uh, put this over there and we'll go to the main page. Alright, so first thing, let's go to the artists and we can see that paging works. We can go next page and previous page and all that goes nicely. We can also go create a new artist called Robert Parker. And there he is. There there he is. He's he's created. Uh, let's go to albums. And uh, we can do paging again over here, you know, first page, second page, third page, all that great stuff. Uh, let's go create a new album called Crystal City. And we're going to set Robert Parker to be the guy who is the artist for this album. Uh, and then, cool, we got this album. Let's delete it. We don't want it anymore. And we just get taken back to the first thing, and we get a little thing that says, ah, oh, yes, we deleted the album Crystal City. Perfect. All right, let's go on to tracks. Uh, we can show paging works as well. Boom, we get new ones. Boom, we go back to the first page. Fantastic. We can sort first by, like, milliseconds, and you can see, you know, they're increasing. We go to the next page, and they're still increasing. Or we can go by bytes, which takes us back to the first page, and then they're increasing by bytes as we go down the list. Hooray! We can also do a search. Let's, uh, let's search for something with the word ball in it, and that'll give us a whole bunch of them. And there's a whole bunch of these, all with the word ball in them, because there's a whole bunch of them in there. Uh, we can also do our advanced search. Uh, let's go track name with A, and artist as ACDC. And we go search, and look at that, we get all the all the tracks with ACDC as the artist with an A in them somewhere. <laughs> Alright, uh, last thing we need to show off is employees. We go on here, we've got the employee tree where it shows everybody as uh, who they report to. You can click on them and you can see information about them. We can also go and see the sales report where we get, for each of the people, we get a sales count and the sales total rounded off because we don't have like, you know, a whole bunch of decimal points of uh, of cents. Uh, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's the uh, employee's tree. And then we've got one last little extra bit of functionality. Uh, we've got this uh, Dart web page here, uh, and all of this, this whole little bit here, this is all written in Dart. And we've got two buttons here, HTMX is the best language? No, it isn't. Ah, but Dart, Dart is the best language, yes it is. Ah. Uh, anyways, if you want to learn more about Dart, I'm going to have a little card on the screen here where you can uh, watch an adventure while I go around and convince everybody that Dart is the best language. Thank you, Carson.